What is up Terraria? My name is Andrew Minecrafter and welcome back to another Terraria video. And today's video is kind of going to be a tutorial. I'm not going to show you a step-by-step -step build. But as you probably read from the title, I'm going to showcase to you guys a really easy thing you can build in your world. And it is a AFK farm for events, snowstorms, blizzards, anything. Pretty much a solar eclipse, like anything like a uh, pumpkin moon, frost moon, pretty much anything you can use this for. And uh, yeah, this is my design. I came up with this myself. And um, yeah, so uh, this is gonna be a quick video. I just wanna show you. So here it is in action. And as you can see, there's an ice golem that just spawned right there. He's absolutely getting wrecked. And most of it is the trap. And a little bit of it is my dragon too. Because if you do compare this with a summoner weapon, you can get some very great uh, hits. And down there I see four icy yo-yos which is amazing shows you how good this trap is like seven ice cores and seven ice fans. there's another ice golem oop another yo-yo just came. actually no there's another ice golem right there you see this trap just farms stuff like crazy we have tons of money down there i'm probably gonna get a platinum when i go down there um but uh yeah let's actually turn the trap off real quickly and um it's great to do it during events um like martian madness i have some up there so the flying saucer and uh pretty much you can just afk and um have a heart statue hooked up here and uh, let me just go outside here and uh let's go pick up the loot and we have a lot of stuff all of this loot and and uh okay so we didn't get the platinum should you be able to got um but we did get a lot looks like we got four amarocks guys and as you can see, which one's the best one? Um, the godly Amarok is the best one. I'm gonna put these banners away and looks like there's another ice golem right there. Uh, I'm gonna leave my dragon to that. Um, and um, let me just show you the wiring real, real quickly. So, um, hold on. So as you can see, the wiring is, is over here. Um, pretty much it's, hooked up to this timer here. And this timer, the blue wire's hooked up to these traps up here, and the green wire's hooked up to everything else. The red wire is hooked up to the teleporters down there, so it can teleport on a pressure pad here. That's how the ice golems keep coming. As you can see, it's a very, very, very awesome, uh, efficient trap. And um, also it's connected to a heart statue, which gives you hearts every like 10 seconds. Um, we have the loot in here, and I'm gonna throw all of this uh, in here. The loot. Um, here we go, and then we have the teleporter hooked up here, which teleports you into the little room. Um, and pretty much I'll show you how the teleporters work. So, okay, here's another ice golem. He's gonna come on the teleporter, as you can see. He's gonna go on the teleporter, and then if he goes on that one, okay, so I don't know why he didn't teleport probably because my dragon was hitting him um but yeah so as you can see it's just a very good trap but they do teleport as you've seen like in the beginning of the video there's like well, like two ice golems that teleported here um but as you can see yeah it is a very efficient trap you get uh frost cores like crazy uh, i have 13 frost cores in here and five ice feathers um you can get other stuff like the martian madness stuff and oh i just turned it on but but um yeah, and you have a heart lantern and campfire here, so you'll never die in the heart statues and stuff. So, um, yeah, thank you for watching this very quick video. Uh, shows you how I set it up, and there you just saw the teleporter in action. Also, we have some dart traps down there, too. Well, thanks for watching this video, guys, and subscribe for more, and uh, yeah, see you in the next one. Peace.